morning. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. I'm Gabs, one half of the Slip Slip Sis duo. Um, and this video is kind of a like mashup of my Aaron, uh, Destination Lane unboxing for April as well as kind of my acquisitions for the month of April. I forgot to pull them all out during mine and my sister's podcast. So I'm kind of just smushing them all in. So first we'll get started with Destination Lane. Destination Lane is a subscription service and every month you you can sign up and there are different tiers. Um, you can sign up for like, I guess it's like the regular, like the classic tier. And in the odd months of the year, you get yarn and the even months of the year, you get bags. The yarn comes from Destination Yarn and the bags come from Erin Lane bags, hence Destination Lane. And they, for the month of the grouping of March and April, they are at Tugela, I think that's how you say it, Tugela Falls in um, South Africa. So they had this beautiful um, green yarn for the month of March. I don't get the yarn because I have too much yarn right now. And as you, you were gonna see, I've acquired a bunch more. Um, but I do get the bags. So I already opened it because I was too excited and I knew I wouldn't be able to unbox till the weekend. So for the even months, you get bags. So this month, we got this super cute bag for Tugela Falls, which is this lovely green color. And it's a little sheep. Let's see if I can do this properly. It's a little sheep and they're parachuting down from the falls and it's like a little um almost kind of looks like a little postcard stamp so it's a huge bag this is one of I think someone in the Facebook group said it's an oops bag so it's really big like super super big like I could put my head in it and it would totally fit it's a box bottom bag super great. I already have one of these from Erin Lane Bags and it's amazing. You can fit a whole sweater's quantity of yarn into it. I think I had a couple sweaters in my other one. So it's super cute. It is drawstring and one of the really cool features about her bags are this, she uses gross grain ribbon so it like won't, the bag won't reopen. Like if you're holding it like this on accident it won't pop down which is really cool. So if you are, I love it's really cute. Um, so if you are interested in signing up for Destination Lane, they open uh, signups in December. So it's it's a year subscription, I believe. So sign up on their website to be notified when they open and all that. This month or this past month, April was also my birthday. So I was super fortunate and I got a lot of lovely yarny goodness. So I'm gonna show you some of the awesome things that I got. So the first thing that I wanna show you is from For the Birds Rehab. It's a, it's like a secondhand online yarn shop where people donate um, their yarn and then she, the woman, Anastasia, resells it at half the price, I think, and then all the proceeds go to helping rehabilitate um, injured birds. And she has, I think, like a, I don't know if it's called a coop, she has something on her back porch where she's rehabilitating birds. I just saw an Instagram story today of like this really cute little goose that she's um, fostering. So I picked up this super cute sock set from Teeny Button Studios. And I'm realizing that if I give my sister some of this yarn, it will fill, it will, my sister, um, I'll try and link the video she's doing, trying to get yarn from 50 states. This is Teeny Button Studios, which is hand dyed out of New Orleans, Louisiana. And I don't think she has Louisiana yet, I'm pretty sure. I know Mandy's Makings was in Louisiana, but I believe she's in Florida now, so who knows? I'll talk to Chaley about this, but look how cute this sock set is. Oh, I love this part, these speckles, super cute. It is called, it is from a very swift, Yarn Club, April 2021. So it's about two years old and the colorway is Fearless, which leads me to believe that this is uh, Taylor Swift inspired. It is fingering weight, 7525, super wash merino, 463 yards. Super cute. I've been wanting a uh, Teeny Button Studios for a little bit and I just couldn't justify 
it until I saw it on further. And I was like, oh, it's for charity. This is great. So, you know, great justification. Super cute. Um, the red, that's actually the only skein that I purchased and I didn't even purchase it. My dad bought it for me and I have to pay it back, but that's whatever. Um, the rest, um, were gifted. So that's super fun. This month I won the spring tea make along prize from White Rose Yarn Company and Kimber's Cozy Creation. So they co-sponsored it. I think I already showed the bag. Oh, I can get the bag. It is a super cute sheepy zipper pouch bag with a handle. It's the, her medium project bag size. I think I may have shown this. It's box bottom. I already got stuff in it. Unfortunately, can't show you what's in it because it is the Knit Picks Mystery Sock Set, which we haven't released that YouTube for. But she was so generous. She sent this to me. And to go along with it, Kimber's Kimber of Kimber's Cozy Creations sent the Little Bo Peep sock set, which I also, so, oh, like how cute is this? They're perfect together. So it is, this is on DK. So my poor sister's not going to get nearly as much as she usually does. This is on a, it's her tough DK sock set, uh, 7525 Subrash Merino and Nylon. Um, the main skein is 100 grams and the mini is 20 grams. How cute is this? And not only that, you're like, this is a great prize. And it totally is. Um, Kimber also sent me other stuff. Let me show you. Um, she also sent this adorable Once Upon a Die volume 10. So I think it's like um, similar to like uh, an experiment or like a one of a kind or like in, uh, one of those kind of colorways. So it's this beautiful like blended of purples and pinks and blues. I love it. Super cute. And it is also a DK weight base because I'm joining my sister on the DK weight kick. And I also got this Once Upon a Die volume 13 in purple. So how cute they like go together. I can make so many cute pairs of cute DK weight socks. So this was an amazing prize that they sent. I'm so fortunate and thank you so much um, for this amazing prize. You, I will put their shops below so you can check them out, support them. Bag is fabulous. I'm going to have so much fun casting on. So, sorry, I'm just chucking my stuff on the floor. Um, I also was fortunate to get some yarn for my birthday from my uncle. He always gives Chaley and I, our uncle, Chaley and I birthday yarn. And I got a sweaters quantity of this beautiful destination yarn. Uh, so I got four skeins. I just didn't pull all four out of the bag. Uh, it is a Tolkien collection. It's from her Lord of the Rings collection. And it's Moria, which I didn't watch the Lord of the Rings, so I'm not really sure what this reference is, but that's okay, because it's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. It is on her 8020 Super Rosh Merino and Silk. It is her first class silk base. I love it. It's so beautiful. So I'm excited for this. It's very, very soft. I also got from my little sister this super cute chicken pouch from shoot I don't know she told me and I don't remember she will comment and correct me I got this super cute little chicken pouch because I'm always playing yarn chicken right and it's got it's knitting um and she also gave me uh, more washi tape which is what I have in here right now washi tape and pens so I can enhance my knitting journal that I've been working on so she gave me other stuff too but these are like the main knitting um so super cute I can't remember the bag maker I def she definitely told me and it's definitely flown my mind flown the coop get it <laughs> um my last thing is for my mother-in-law so my mother-in-law if you've been watching us for a while is a she crochets but she also quilts and she makes bags and she makes dresses and all these things for my daughters so I got this super cute bag from my mother-in-law like this isn't this so cute? So it's like kind of like a carpet bag almost where it like pops open. And then in the, it's, I love the print. I love bright colors. So, and it's got all these cute pockets in it and it's got a zipper, but it's like one of those zippers, like the kind um, you use for your like jacket. So it like fully opens and I can, oopsies, I can 
zip it closed. So isn't that so cute? And it's got an outside pocket. So I'm thinking it'll be, see, what? I'm thinking it'll be fabulous for like taking my projects with me on the go, maybe for my cozy memories. And then inside the bag that she gave me, oh, I forgot to take it out, that's okay, is this super cute self-striving yarn this really cute blue color. It's called Sea Glass and it's by Two Sisters, a yarn company on Etsy out of Billings, Montana, which I don't know if my sister has Montana either for her, for her, um, what are we calling it? 50 skeins of America? Her 50 skeins of America. So maybe she'll get my leftovers of this too. And then she will be able to check off Montana and Louisiana, hopefully. Anyway, so thank you so much for tagging along in my short little acquisitions video, and I will hope to see you next time.